Books is about Kate and Kate's story. She's a 30-something nuclear physicist who's struggling to kind of be seen and be heard in her workplace. Kate's story is one that anyone in any job in any era could relate to. We've got live action, uh, we've got Bunraku puppetry and we've got shadow puppetry. So we've got these three really cool cinematic um, ways of telling a story and they sort of, it's about linking them uh, all together as well as we tell the story of Kate. At Smoking Apples we tend to work with very human puppets. It really magnifies their actions so when you're watching it um, as an audience member we hope that you get that bit of distance that can kind of really help you look at what they're doing a bit more closely and look at human action a bit more closely. Our previous show's Cell was about motor neuron disease and In Our Hands was about trawler fishing um, so we wanted to find a new subject that would challenge us to understand it and to explain it visually and also give the audiences something new to find and learn during the show. From a design perspective, I was really interested in sort of the periodic table and the way that's developed and the way that's kind of, and that sort of became the backdrop design for the set. So the sets, you know, these different Tetris-like blocks that sort of interlink and separate and join together and can make so many different configurations and yeah, that's something that we really like doing at Smoking Apples is taking a set and not just using the item once but using the item 15 times in 15 different ways. We really hope that people come away from Flux, you know, feeling empowered. I think everyone understands what it feels like to be struggling, to get your voice heard, to find a different position, to balance work and life. And, you know, these issues in Flux are very much to do with Kate and her life. But I think everyone can kind of relate to that. And so if people can come away sort of feeling like, you know, they've shared that with each other and with Kate on stage, then that would be amazing.